Yo, what is up everyone? Today I'm going to be showcasing the best mechanics routine that you can do every day to train your mechanics. You can spend as much time as you like, but even 30 minutes will help every day. The first thing you want to do is just go to the free ball. It gets everything warmed up, so you do it for around 5 minutes before you move on. But it's really just the basis for everything. It doesn't necessarily get you better mechanics, it's just there so your drills for later are just more easier for you. After completing the free build drill, you want to head into aim drill cone aim training. Here you just want to basically just uh, train your aim, just line up the shotgun to the head and just try to hit max pumps and just keep your cross out on the head with the SMG as well. Just keep doing this repeating, 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 switching between the two guns for about a bit, 4 minutes, 5 minutes and yeah. Next, head into bounce tracking. Here, it's just all about tracking with your SMG. I love the burst SMG so much, that's why like, I always use it. It's so good for tracking on controller especially. And just keep doing this for about a good 5 minutes again, 4 minutes. Moving on to that, we have edit training V4. Select the following options that you wish to have and do this for about a good 4 or 5 minutes. Here you just want to practice just editing along the red circles. These are like the efficient way and the fastest way to complete an edit. Very minimal and in a fight it will be so crucial for you to have those quick edits to get out of the box or even just make a quick peek and reset. So do this for about a good 4 or 5 minutes. Next guys, we are hopping into Peace Control X Peak Training. Instead of just going to the course guys like normal, it's important that you right hand peak the bot. That way your mechanics aren't just faster, but applicable to any game. As I come up to this bot, instead of just wide editing on them, I'm going to make sure I take a good peek. That way I don't form any bad habits when it comes to actually firing. Alright guys, so the last thing is to head it back into free build, but this time you're going to spawn the bots and the point of this part of the video is that you're just going to like round up everything you've just done for the past couple minutes and all you want to do here is just kind of like clip the bots. Alright guys, so after that we are going into Marta's turtle fights, code is on the screen. So in this map it's just about box fights really and you just respawn every single time you die. I'll do this map for a good 10 minutes, 15 minutes. You'll be like so warmed up after this guys, trust me you will. And this infinite respawn, the point of this is to just go for like clips against people, warm up the aim, try to put max pumps and it gets you into like tough scenarios so this is a very good map to do. Even pros like Mario and Kyle do it, so it's worth it guys, try it out. The second last thing you guys want to do in this video is to just head into 1v1s, prefer Raider 464 but here I'm one v one my friend. You can do public, just first different people, first different playstyles, get used to just first different people in general, practice all your peaks, just keep edit coursing, go for clips, go for pumps, go to max pumps and yeah that's it guys so 
next thing in this part is the scrim. So be sure to watch how I played the scrim. First scrim, first win. You guys get me. I'm just so good. So make sure you guys watch it. I play. This is not Fortnite. This is not Fortnite, man. What is it? No such thing as high ground. What the hell did I just play? 